Yeah, go ahead. This is Put your hands out. together. Yeah, this is... A... And then I look. And you go, yeah, <laughs> now turn sideways. Now look. Oh, okay. and then, wow, it's a magic and trick. And then you lay That's... in bed with your friend. I, I have. Think, uh, I think Parcells just fired me, thank you. <laughs> I have done that, awesome. actually, yes. Of course, yes. every guy growing up... But he was talking about thing. the strangest thing you, you, you fucked. No. Or jerked off just, or no, you, you, right. But then he was saying that the butted roll would look like it. Well, you, you wouldn't butter... fuck the butted roll, would you? Well, you? You cut a little of your hair so you think there's hair on you, know, like a pussy. And... You would actually jerk off with a butted roll. You gotta try everything once. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> Christ! Look at little seeds on it—the little caraway oh. seeds. I'm chafing! <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right. Well, you want to take one more? Another guy that jerked off with his friends, Jason in New York. Jason, go ahead. Hi. How you guys doing? Hey. Um, I've had a similar experience, but mine basically started out, I guess, the first move being a truth or dare game. You know where I. You know, I I actually thought it was perfectly normal for best friends to be do, doing it. Um, it's sort of like it, I always had the friends, well, I've never jerked off in my life. It's basically a bunch of bullshit. Are you saying, uh, it, what are you, you saying? <laughs> <laughs> basically, I, I jerked off with my friends, too, uh, perfectly. I'm not gay, don't yeah, have any gay thoughts, but I've done it. Yeah, what's the, and it's no big deal. But you and yeah, it's no big deal when you're young. That's something guys do. You're grown up. I mean, I remember when I was younger, and you know, me and you know, friends, you play doctor and stuff. That was you know, but yeah. you were young and you couldn't even get hard, so it was a waste of time, you know. But you know, you just touch. And, I would do know. that. Play doctor and perform uh, mastectomies. Kind of uh, got the neighborhood kids a little scared. <laughs> uh, Boomer from Jersey, boss, reality check: jerking off in the uh, jerking off with a guy in the woods is gay. Jerking off of the guy in bed isn't. <laughs> you're you're bashing a guy for jerking off with another guy in the woods. <laughs> Meanwhile, you were in bed with a guy. You were in bed. With him? Well, I wasn't in bed. I was sleeping over. You were in his bed. bed. You were in his bed. You said you were in bed. You shared the same bed, and you would jack it with in bed. With this little yeah. New York Mets sheets. <laughs> 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 Smiling Mr. Met face. Right. <laughs> Looking right at you in the with eye. shame. <laughs> <laughs> well, nothing like that for a girl's Bonnie. Was there any ever growing up with another girl or yeah, a girl's Bonnie. party? Help us out here with a hot little each story. other or something. I didn't I didn't uh, masturbate until I was eighteen. Really? Yeah. So there wasn't any like <laughs> cool stories? Do no. your girlfriends tell you stories about that when they're sleepovers? There was, I, yeah, I mean, yeah. there was a couple of stories about, you know, a girl got fingered. <laughs> fingered, yeah, that was a biggie. <laughs> that was a it big one. It sounded little... horrible. It did? Yeah. Yeah, it's got to be. <laughs> little 15-year-old digging in there like he's trying to pull out a booger out of his nose. <laughs> yeah, she's digging this shit, so I fingered her. She was digging it. Yeah, she's wincing. Let's... Ouch. Let's say hi to... You guys know nothing back then. Let's say hi to uh, Jeff in Jersey. I tried to eat a yeah. pussy and she didn't even, you know, she couldn't get past the first bite. Oh, Fucking <laughs> bitch. Oh, <God. laughs> Go ahead, Jeff. Why is there any question uh, if uh, Voss is gay? Didn't you used to suck dick for drugs? No, that was all bullshit. I never sucked a dick for drugs. You know, I tell a story about, you know, uh, whatever the joke was. And yeah. these people, I mean, he sucked Oh, big, they'll pick no, up on I it. I know. Listen, I've done some wild things for drugs. I'd rob, I'd steal, I connive, but I never su had sucked a cock. Because I know if I would have got money doing that, I'd be, you know, doing it, whatever. But I know, I never, you know, something. Uh, You'd be one. good at it, right? Is that you know? <laughs> you're funnier. You know? <laughs> it's got to be embarrassing if you're gay and you're real good, or not gay, yeah, and you're really you good just, at sucking yeah. dick. That's got to be you're embarrassing. Just a prodigy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. What do you mean by prime? Oh. Uh, <laughs> great Charles. <laughs> well, I mean, it's. What do you want to do here, Ant? The phones have exploded. I Everyone know. wants to admit, admit that they jerked off with their pals. Nick in New York, go ahead. Hey, what's up, fellas? Uh, actually, the, um, there was a group of friends, and uh, one of the guys came up with the idea of doing a circle jerk, and we were like, nah, man, forget that. And we all got weirded out. And now, the funny ending to the story is that uh, about five years <laughs> later, I ran into the guy, and he turned out to be gay, man. I'm talking about Liberace gay. Oh, yeah. Liberace. What, dead from AIDS? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, That's Liberace that gay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, That's true. All right. Yeah.
All right, punch it out. We'll take one military story and then we'll take a break. Brad and Dallas, go ahead. Hey, what's up, fellas? Hey. When uh, when I was stationed in Japan, I was on a uh, ship in the Navy. Oh, boy. And uh, the first girl that we got stationed that was sent to our ship, her first job was to clean the bathroom we used to all beat off in. <laughs> and, uh, God damn. Lucky her. But we used to, like, beat it off and throw it on the walls and shit. So she goes up there and she cleans all the stall walls. And she hangs this, like, thick cardboard paper on the walls that we used to use to, like, lay on the floor whenever we were painting or whatever. She lines the walls with this shit so that when she has to clean it again, she'll just rip the paper off the wall. So we get the idea that from now on when we beat on the wall, we're going to throw it on there and autograph the shit. Like a fucking monkey cage. Oh, that's great. <laughs> you gotta put papers on it. That's great. I was gonna, uh, I was gonna uh, move on, Amp, but Tin Man. I mean, Tin Man. How do you do that? Yeah, say what you have to say, Tin Man. <laughs> we the shit out of the fuck was uh, a lampshade. You, you, you had sex with a lampshade. <laughs> Is you that know, your I first time with a Jew? You're looking for something to stick it in, and you know. The top of the lampshade with it, where it sits on the light bulb, it's like... <laughs> oh, God, it's awesome. Wow. Uh, I'm hearing you, sir. Go ahead. I have no idea how he does this. Well, you know the metal part that uh, hangs on the actual light bulb? Right. Is that what you were having fun with? Yeah. How would you <laughs> How would you have sex with that? Well, you lubricate it with Vaseline, and, you know, you make sure you have a condom on. So Isn't it, doesn't... it metal? Yeah. Well, he's got the condom and he lubricates it really, really I could good. find ten other things around the house that I'd rather fuck <laughs> than a lampshade metal bracket. I didn't have many options. <laughs> you don't have many options. <laughs> All right. Thank you, sir. All right. Jerk in the army. First one done. Had to... Had to what? Had to what? Army. Had to do dishes. What? Anthony. Hey, what's up, man? Hey. Hey, we made a bunch of guys, man, when we was in the military. I had four roommates. We used to get together and put pillows up and block ourselves off. The first one done beating off, had to do the dishes. <clears throat> first one done? Well, wouldn't you just go really dishes. slow? He wanted to prolong it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but, no, like, yeah the, the good guy, the guy that can prolong it. Yeah, wouldn't it be yeah, the, the last one done? <laughs> the first one, man. The jerk-off session would take 30 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're getting a bunch of these. Uh, Rob from Jersey, I used to bang my couch while looking at pictures of the 1996 girls' gymnastics team. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who was well, on that team? I don't know what's Wasn't that the one with uh, Carrie Strug? Was that the Carrie Strug year? And it's Dominique something. Uh, Dawn. Yeah. Dawn yeah. or whatever. Dawn's. Uh, uh, that's uh, wait, that's gay. No, that's really perverse. No, it's gay to know the the, gym, the gymnastics team from 90s. Any, <laughs> Why? To know any Should I know the weightlifters or ring guys? <laughs> yeah, Voss. We like girls. You know the girls? <laughs> oh, you're right. Perky, that's not gay. You're perky right. girls. No, I mean the gay. Uh, Sorry, we don't know the Greco wrestling team. <laughs> Sim G Kim Zemeskel. Kim yeah. Zemeskel. That was her? See? That oh, year yeah. she was in that one? Yeah. Uh, this guy used to cut a slit in liver or steak. Oh God! And have that is sex so with it. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> and then fry it up and eat you, it. You marinate your own steak. What the oh, hell? God. This guy had a sex with a, an entire uh, I didn't deli blue ham. cheese on my steak. Uh, he bored a hole in it and pounded away in the walk-in refrigerator at a deli I worked at. He's Not sure if it ever got used because I got fired that night. Oh God! You. All right, Anthony, one more phone call. I'm and, sure. uh, it's been pointed out that there is uh, no irony at all in the fact that Voss plays Scrabble. <laughs> 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 Are you good at it? Four-letter word. He plays <laughs> expert. I play, no, Ooh. not expert. I play advanced. You play expert. I play uh, Online? No, against the computer, against me. Oh, okay. Because yeah. I, was, I was playing chess online until I found out I was like beating like ten year old kids. And I, felt, I know. I felt guilty at so many levels. I'm like, what am I doing? Conversing with a ten year old online, first of all. You want to jerk <laughs> off after <laughs> this game? <laughs> I know. Compare <laughs> sizes. <laughs> yeah, compare sizes. I'm I, a I, slumber party tonight. I, I I started getting back into chess really fast, so I was I was playing online and I'm just kicking ass left and right, and finally, and I'm thinking I'm just you know playing people around my age, you know, and also. All of a sudden, uh, someone decides to you know converse with me. He's like, "Wow, you're pretty good. How old yeah. are you? I'm eight. <laughs> and what? I'm like, I couldn't cop to like my oh. real age. I'm like, "Oh, I'm uh, 15." That's what I do with checkers, <laughs> and that's too old. That's I, I know that that was too old. That's what I do. I'm playing checkers, you know, against people. You want to play again? No, the babysitter said lights out. <laughs>
And and it's bad that you're now lying about your age and conversing with him because if it's a cop, it's right, like, right. okay, here's a guy now right, right, right. Yeah. lying about his age. I, know. I, I was done at that point when I found Martin's out there were eight-year-olds, 10-year-olds, 12-year-olds. I'm like, I can't do this anymore. Yeah. There's just something very wrong about this, even though it's an innocent game of chess. Darren in New York, what's up? Starts that way, and what's, then someone's got a hey, bishop up their ass. Hey, what's going on, Owen? How we doing? We're having a good time today. It's uh, it's. Yo, I, I just be, before I even get into my story, I just want to let you guys know, man. I, I'm so happy to hear you guys again on the radio. It so seems like I was so depressed when you guys were. Off. I got to tell you something really fast, Darren. Uh, you know, I'm reading the email every day, and it seems like just only recently a lot of our old fans are really starting to, you know, find us and and get the XM. It's really strange. Listen, I went out and bought a brand new car. Just to get XM put in it so that I can listen to you guys. Oh, uh, thank you, Darren. I, so I, I went out and bought one of those, my, not my father, the, the Delphi ones, and I tried putting it in my car, and it just, I would get intermittent, intermittent service, so I had to get rid of it, and then I got you guys online. I found, I found out that you guys, I could get you guys online, so cool. I, used to, I used to listen to you at work. All right. And now all I right. say, you know something, I have to get an XM car. I got to get a car with XM so I can listen to all you. Right. All, all right, all right, Darren. All right, get into my story. Now, the guy, well, whoever answered the phone, he doesn't believe me, but what I used to do when I was younger, much younger, I used to use my grandfather's sander, an electronic sander, and I would, you know, throw my throw my dick kind of like down in between in, in between my legs and put the sander there, and it gives you, it gives you a sensation. Gives you a real nice sensation. I found out <laughs> like that. a belt sander or a vibrating like a vibrating sander. All right, oh, yeah. I've seen these kind of sanders. They're they're like yeah. circular. No, they go back and forth. They go like that. They they. Uh, I've seen the ones that kind of go in a yeah. circle. Yeah, they're right. round and go in a circle, or yeah. the square yeah. ones that kind of go exactly. forward and back. Exactly, exactly. I found out by accident one day I was on my bike and I had a sander, and it was on, and all of a sudden I was like, "Oh shit, what the hell is that?" And I said, "Hey, wait, a minute. that feels kind of good." And I tried it, and I tell you, for a couple of years, I used to sneak out. A couple of, the of years. You know, but everyone was asleep. You just brought back a memory. I used to rock the, the weed whacker. What? <laughs> oh, yeah, man. I used to rock the weed whacker. I, what? The vibrations that came off that thing. My parents couldn't understand why I I wanted That's to dangerous. weed whack the you know around the house like once a week.